everyone and welcome to the Greece from Home initiative. My name is Ted Lelekas. I am a wine communicator and this is my home. You know, for us Greeks, the notion of home has always been extremely important. It's um, part of a quality that's um, written into our DNA, which is the quality of hospitality. Or, as we like to uh, say it in Greek, philoxenia. Philoxenia, even the word, comes from two separate ancient Greek words, philos, which means friend, and xenos, which means stranger. And that says a lot. It says that for us, even the stranger is someone that we need to make feel at home when he's with us. So um, today I want to show you um, something about Greek wine. We're going to talk a lot about uh, Greek wine over the next uh, series of videos, but today I thought I, was, um, I should start with uh, a Greek grape variety called Agiorgitico. Agiorgitico is a red grape variety and it's actually one of our um, ambassador grape varieties as we call them. It's, um, uh, it has a very, very rich history. It's um, well known all across Greece and um, it's um, becoming very, very um, uh, uh, famous abroad as well. Agiorgitico comes from um, uh, the area of Nemea in the Peloponnese. Now, even the name, I know, can be a bit of a mouthful, Agiorgitico, but you might want to call it uh, St. George's wine, because <laughs> effectively that's what it is. Nemea, you see, uh, is a small town that has a patron saint, and that is St. George. So this is St. George's wine. When we talk about uh, Agiorgitico to um, international audiences, we call it a crowd pleaser. Why? Because um, uh, it's, well, it's exactly what it says. It's um, a wine that um, people will always like. It's very, very mellow, it's round, it's extremely versatile and very food friendly. On the nose, it's um, uh, very gentle. It's quite refined. Um, you might um, want to compare it with uh, uh, an international grape variety like um, Sangiovese from Italy, for instance, or Merlot for France, exactly because they are equally um, elegant. Now, on the palate, it's a wine that's so um, easygoing that um, you can have it on its own. You can have it, um, well, effectively, any time of the day. Um, uh, anytime you crave a nice glass of uh, red wine to, um, you know, get you going, to get your appetite started or to socialize with friends or you can have it with food and uh, uh, food-wise it's um, extremely um, agile as to how it can be paired. So you can have it um, with uh, a bit of cheese in its uh, simplest form with everyday uh, fare that we have here in Greece like um, uh, vegetarian dishes with uh, a light red sauce maybe or, obviously, with um, red meat dishes. And um, if you were in Nemea, uh, the locals there would probably serve it to you with um, a um, very characteristic, typical uh, local dish, like um, rooster, young rooster, slowly cooked with pasta. Um, kind of like our own version of um, kokova. Now, for us Greeks, as I told you, um, the notion of sharing is, um, uh, is very, very important because uh, sharing is what brings people together. Now, during poor times, during difficult times, sharing um, wasn't very easy because people had not much at their disposal. So um, they had to be very creative and very um, imaginative. But at the same time, they needed to make sure that people felt at home and comfortable at their house. So um, things like uh, cheese and especially mature cheese um, slowly dehydrated cheese that would last a bit longer or rusks again something like um, deliberately old and stale bread again made so that it would last longer you see poverty um, uh, sometimes and uh, hardship makes people uh, creative but at the same time makes them even more needy of um, other people's company and um, let's be honest us Greeks um, had a, have had our um, fair share of um, times like these now nowadays we live in um, diff difficult times um, strange times times that um, we haven't experienced before but um, I think we're going to um, get through it. I'm uh, positive, I'm optimistic, I think we need to stay positive. Initially, we have to stay home, we have to stay safe, we have to enjoy our wine and um, hope for the future. This was my first uh, um, Greece from Home 
uh, video. I hope you enjoyed it and um, hopefully I'll be back for more. For the time being, stay safe. Bye.